An indigenous market vendor, Jacinta Francisco Marshall, was recently released after Mexican authorities decided not to contest the appeal to her 21-year sentence. Marshall served three years in prison after being convicted of kidnapping six federal agents. Rice activists say her trial was full of irregularities and that Marshall was not given access to an interpreter as required by law. Finalmente, después de más de tres años de permanecer, Finally, after more than three years of being kept unfairly in jail, Jacinta Francisco Marcia was set free. A member of the Nanu community, the woman was falsely accused of kidnapping elements from the now defunct Federal Investigative Office. Marcia denied that she was among 80 and 100 angry vendors who briefly held federal agents hostage in the central state of Querétaro in March 2006 after authorities raided a street market to confiscate pirated goods. I just cried a lot during the first day that I was in prison. I could not stop crying because I could not believe that I was in jail. I knew that I was innocent. I knew that I was there unjustly. Amnesty International named her a prisoner of conscience and called for her release. This was done after the appeals process revealed contradictions in statement of federal agents, the Federal Attorney General's office said in statement. Con el tiempo, el caso de Jacinta se ha convertido Over the time, Jacinta case became a scandal and an example of the way that the justice system in our country works. It not only is weak and inefficient, but also in some cases punishes individuals for conscience or identity reasons. Marcia's lawyer, Andres Diaz, who works with the Mexican Debate's Human Rights Center, say her team is considering bringing legal action against the government. Activists say her case was symbolic of a poor treatment meted out to Mexico's six million speakers of indigenous languages. TATV Weekly.